Hi guys, this is Ali McVera once again, and this time I'm not doing a review video like I usually do. Um, this is just me ranting, actually. This is just me uh, talking, hopefully to some people uh, out in the Vera Bradley world who uh, would like to get or hear opinions from their um, customers. And um, this is that kind of video. I have uh, just checked the new colors for this new fall 2013 season. And once again, I'm hugely disappointed with um, the patterns. Um, I will admit that I like very specific patterns and um, I'm one of those more traditional, I guess, um, shoppers uh, don't like super busy busy with lots of colors um, items so as you can see these items in here they usually stay within the same realm of colors so anyways um, I wanted to make this video I really want to hear your opinions as well uh, tell me what you think about the new colors um, and uh, I also want to share with you what I would like Vera Bradley to continue or bring back make them uh, we're talking about patterns in here. We're talking about items. We're also going to talk about features within this item. So let's get started. Currently, I'm using my bowler, uh, and this is in totally Turk. Um, I am one of those recent uh, Vera Bradley fans. I um, did not get started with my collection until maybe three years ago. And this actually, this pattern was the one that brought me to Vera Bradley. Um, before this pattern, I wasn't really too thrilled with the um, Vera Bradley items. And this pattern, I thought it was so gorgeous, so beautiful, um, that this is actually one of the first items I purchased. And I really loved it. So anyway, I would love, love for Vera Bradley to bring this pattern back uh, because, of course, I didn't get to buy many things um, but only a couple of items. Um, and so, <sighs> Totally Turk will be the first pattern I would like Vera Bradley to bring back. Also, I would like for them to make this bowler again, um, closer look into this kind. Um, the new bowler, I don't really care much about it. Uh, I looked into one of them and it just didn't look as good as this one. So I did not purchase another bowler. And so um, what I like about uh, these bags, um, and as you can see, I'm using this right now. I love this quilted uh, pockets. Um, it's not that the other kinds of pockets are necessarily bad or they're gonna rip, but I find these pockets a lot, I don't know. I like how they feel. I like how, how they fold, um, hold my items in it. For some reason, maybe it's just me, call me crazy, but it feels that whenever I put items in here in this kind of pocket, they're not gonna fall out. But yet, I've done the same thing with other purses that don't have quilted pockets, and they don't hold the items, small items, especially something like this, as well. Maybe it's just me, I'm not sure. Call me crazy, but that's how I feel about this. So I would love for them also to be, bring that feature in their bags, which is quilted pockets. Now this uh, this pattern it is my very favorite pattern right now, um, and I have a few items in that, and I'm sorry I haven't done any more review videos, but I will soon. Um, Paisley meets plaid. It's everything I ever <laughs> dreamed for in Avira Bradley. I love pink. Pink is my favorite color, and this bag says it all. This is just Ali McVira everywhere in here. And so I would love for them to continue this. They're fading it away. They are uh, getting rid of all their uh, Paisley meets plaid items. And I would love for them to, com to continue. So pattern number two for me would be uh, Paisley meets plaid. Now, one of my very favorite, I have to say, is Java Blue. Uh, I have a lot of items. I have luggage in Java Blue. And they just continue doing it. And they brought back the... Um, cell phone cover for it which is cool and but I would love for them to bring items in Java blue again it's such a nice color it goes with so many things I would also love for them to bring back this um, not just a clutch 
purse um, because I find uh, when I'm going to spend $75 or $100 in a bag, I want this bag to be have multiple, multiple uses. Uh, and I find this bag to be one of the few that you can do that with. So I don't know if you've seen my um, review on this bag, but you can actually carry it as a clutch or just as a shoulder purse. Uh, so you can dress it up and down, and I think that's a good thing um, when I'm buying. That's one of the things that I look for when I'm purchasing my Vera Rally items. So the pattern will be Java Blue that I wanted back, and I want this uh, purse to be back as well. Now, you can still find this item, um, the Vera Rally um, online shop, and it's the... Um, companion attache in mocha rouge so my next pattern would be mocha rouge please 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 Vera Bradley bring it back I absolutely love it I have many items in this uh, pattern and I just absolutely love it also this bag I love it I have carried it with me I carry it with me like almost all the time this is my number one bag when it comes to work related bags um, and I really want it back. They only made it in two different patterns, and this is this was one of them. The other one was in Boysenberry, I think it's called, but I never really cared much about that one, so I didn't purchase it in that pattern. So please, Vera Bradley, bring it back. So awesome to travel with as well. And again, if you're gonna spend $170 in a bag, you wanna use this bag for more than just traveling or more than just work. So if you can have that going on for me Vera Bradley people I would love for you to bring this back so I can have it in more patterns and use it as much as I do for traveling and work okay moving on again in here in Java blue I have the Metropolitan um, I have this in several patterns and this is my number two bag for bags to take with me to work because I can fit my laptop in here so um, that's very important thing but that's not the only reason I use this Metropolitan for I have trouble with this like I said I have a, um, a Java blue carry-on bag and I'm sure you've seen it I hope you've seen my my review on that and I've traveled with this thing as well I went to Brazil I think it was last year and I took this Metropolitan with the carry-on and actually took this with me because I can stick it inside and be really easy to access uh, for my um, documents like passport and things like that and so I would love Vera Bradley for you to um, make more metropolitan bags with more options um, there are a few left in your website and different patterns but I either already have them or I don't care about them so if you can please Vera Bradley people bring this item back it will be so so good for me um, and um, I think that's about it everything that I can think of uh, so p please Vera Bradley listen to your loyal customers like I am and um, here are complaints because I really have heard a lot of people on either YouTube or actually some reviews on the uh, Vera Bradley website of some of the items and we beg you please listen to us they seem not to be listening and so we need to unite and make a statement as a group rather than each one of us just talking on our own so tell me what you think um tell me how you feel about those new patterns ugly new patterns i have to say i don't care much about any of them so please be our valley hear us out and please subscribers let me know what you think i'll talk to you later bye guys